Bobby Brookside is a Liverpool wrestler. Shane saw him at a pub last night fighting, beating up people. Look at the hair on this guy. Well, this could be another Milan miracle, or perhaps it could be a McMahon massacre. Bobby Brookside, a football jersey wearing tear. This is there. We're going to get to see Shane McMahon in action. And allegedly, Robbie Brookside is the uh, toughest man in the UK. There's the McMahon dragon right there. This guy's the toughest guy in the United Kingdom. And Robbie Slay the Dragon King. He's got some flames. Uh, some fire breathing dragon. He's got the flames on his on his pants already. <laughs> Might get lit up here if he's not careful. Well, Shane McMahon, certainly known for his uh, his battling ways, side headlock on Robbie Brookside. Oh, <laughs> Shane may give uh, Robbie Brookside a little wrestling lesson. Looks like nice headlock, headlock takeover. Uh oh, hey, and and Brookside counters. Shane McMahon is extremely athletic. Oh, nice arm drag takedown, and. Uh, Shane O'Mac beating Robbie Brookside back up to the vertical base. You're not in a pub, a local pub now, Robbie Brookside. They don't get, they don't get a lot of sun over here either, do they, Gaylor? Well, the collar and elbow tie up, and Shane McMahon waist lock takedown floats over Whoa. quickly in the ride, <laughs> and Shane McMahon oh, oh, ow. Ow. shot to the kidneys, and another four into the back of the head, and Robbie Brookside from Liverpool is being pummeled by Shane McMahon. Well, the dragon is, uh, he said, getting vicious right now. Oh, can you remember Shane McMahon made this a no disqualification matchup, which may not bode well for young master Brookside before it's all said and done. And no holds barred as well. Shane can pretty much do anything he wants to. Well, of course, so can Robbie. Oh. Brookside having trouble getting out of the blocks, if you will. Shane McMahon, certainly, whether you like him or not, is fearless and is very handy with those fists. Wow. And look at the footwork, JR. Shane McMahon, 6'2", 235 or 40 pounds. He's in great shape. We don't see him that often. But every time we do, Shane McMahon makes an impact. And he's made impact time after time again against some of the biggest superstars. Oh, wait a minute. And the WWE. Speaking of impact, they are. And it is a, again, no disqualification matchup, which means that trash can is perfectly legal here tonight. And what do you think the dragon, Shane O'Mac, has in mind right now, JR? Oh, he can wedge that trash can in between the bottom and second rope. Oh, this, this young man. Brookside incapacitated. Brookside has a semi-conscious here, and Shane O'Mac. Well, I think we know what we're about to see. Shane. It's the patented Shane McMahon maneuver. And you gotta say that Shane McMahon has no fear. Is he gonna try it here? Shane McMahon on the top turnbuckle. You and don't throw it! Oh, 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 man! Shane McMahon goes coast to coast, putting his own body at risk but it was Robbie Brookside who took a bite out of that trash can. I think that's it. Hey, Robbie, I forgot to tell you. I can't believe this, but uh, this is a uh, two-on-one handicap match. Uh-oh. Allow me to introduce you to my tag team partner, the Samoan Bulldozer, Umaga. Well, King, we've just seen Robbie Brookside, the victim of, of a car crash, <laughs> and now we've got a semi-truck on his way to the ring by the name of Umaga, the animalistic, dangerously disruptive Umaga. Oh, he's not a semi-truck, JR. He's a bulldozer. <laughs> oh, no. And it was only seven days ago that Umaga to Bobby Lashley lost the Intercontinental title, so one can only imagine the kind of mood that Umaga's in. And we just saw Shane tag his, his partner into the match. Brookside thinks he's been in a severe car crash. 
This is about is in a demolition derby right now. A human demolition derby. And Umaga, plus to 400 pounds, and Shane McMahon taking turns on a un unprotected, defenseless. Oh, Brookside is decimated by Umaga, the Samoan bulldozer. Shane McMahon directing traffic. And I would suggest that, I was gonna say Brookside needs to get out of the ring, but actually Brookside needs some EMTs out here right now. Look at this young man from, from oh. Liverpool. Can, he's absolutely in a defenseless state. And you gotta wonder that, wondering out loud, is this a loud and clear message back to ECW's Bobby Lashley? Well, I don't think, uh, doesn't take Einstein to figure that out. Umago top. Oh, come on, no, wait a minute, no! A huge splash from the near 400 pounder right on the chest cavity of, of this helpless young man, Robbie Brookside. Brookside endured the coast to coast from Shane O'Mac, and now that huge splash. Robbie, I forgot to tell you, well, we forgot to tell you that it's a, not a two-on-one handicap match. It's a three-on-one handicap match. What? So, ladies and gentlemen, everybody on your feet and pay homage to the chairman of the board, Vincent Kennedy oh. McMahon. You gotta be kidding me. Mr. McMahon is going to come out here and be the third member of this tag team? No chance. There's the shades of this Sunday's backlash. And here comes Satan's role model. Mr. McMahon, the chairman of the WWE, the demonic head of the first family of sports entertainment. Look at that hat they are. Is that a, is that a derby? I would suggest, King, that would be a derby. <laughs> Privately vengeful after Bobby Lashley led the, the shaving of the chairman's head at WrestleMania 23. I mean, man, isn't exactly dressed to compete, but well, there's not even, there's not much competition left, is there? There's barely any balls. Oh, wait a minute! Look at this! Look! Jay Hart, call it! Mr. McMahon shoots the half Nelson. No over a you are your winner. Shane McMahon, Umaga, and Mr. McMahon. I guess Mr. McMahon wanted to make sure Robbie wasn't going anywhere. And, and you got to tell him what a great victory this and was. You got to wonder if Bobby Lashley is going to be tortured just like this on Sunday at Backlash. This could be the beginning of the longest week in Bobby Lashley's life. Well, I don't think Robbie Brookside is going to see backlash. He's not seeing anything right now. As I mentioned earlier, the fire-breathing dragon flew coast to coast and delivered that steel garbage can right to the mouth of Robbie Brookside. But that wasn't all, Jay. Oh, if that wasn't enough, then Umaga oh, would almost be head. Brookside, and then this king. Oh, my. And then Mr. McMahon picked the bones of a defenseless individual. Could this be the outcome this Sunday at Backlash when Bobby Lashley's ECW championship is on the line? And King, speaking of Bobby Lashley. Well, uh, yeah, speaking of Bobby Lashley and Backlash, uh, he's got his work cut out for it before he gets to Backlash because... Tomorrow night, live on ECW, Bobby Lashley is going to take on Umaga one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, man. Ladies and gentlemen, Umaga, Mr. McMahon and Shane McMahon, three men who fully intend to geld ECW champion Bobby Lashley of his self-respect and to forcibly take the ECW championship at Backlash. And folks, what a WrestleMania rematch we have tonight. Shawn Michaels. John Cena, take it back to WrestleMania 23. Yeah.